Hello everyone, welcome to Darko Stocks. So this is a short presentation about Darko Stock subscription which we have opened today and we'll walk you through all the points step by step. In order to make this crisp, we have tried to keep it as short as possible. So if you are planning to take subscription of Darko Stocks, we would strongly recommend you to watch this presentation before you actually subscribe to Darko Stocks. So, these are the fields that Darko Stocks operate. Right now we are operating in the field of data analytics, data aggregation, mutual funds, stock market, research and blog and personal finance. Now, uh, for all those who are not very comfortable with English as the primary language, we will also upload the second video of exactly the same presentation in Hindi. So we can cover more audience and we can be more clear to the people who are not familiar with the English. So coming to the next point, the why is Darko stocks not SEBI registered? First of all, we are not SEBI registered and you need to keep that in mind before you take the subscription. And we often get this question a lot of times that why are we not SEBI registered? Well, the first of all, the core reason for this is that why should we take the SEBI registration? We are not into any advisory business. We don't provide target prices. We don't provide entry exit prices or any stop loss prices. It's not our job to provide any kind of tip. Okay, our job is to provide only information like you are reading an article in the Forbes. You don't need a subscription or like a, a savvy registration for the for writing the articles. Okay, so we don't feel the need to take savvy registration for publishing the articles about the company. Now, what you choose to do with those articles is completely up to you. Our articles are basically informational about information about the companies that it should be highlighted to the users. Okay, we bring the companies to the attention of the users. And one more thing is that if you observe all other brokerages, advisories out there, they are SEBI registered. But if you observe the kind of reports they publish, the kind of articles they write about, there is quite a lot of restriction on them because they don't want to take the responsibility for finding new companies. The companies that we suggest, if you check online or you check any of the sources, I would we are, we are very confident that almost 80 to 90 percent of the companies are not even on the radar of any analyst out there okay so it's not that we are going to we are providing any kind of investment services or specifically say tips for investing in these companies or these are the multi beggars there are very high chances that a lot of these companies might fail okay we want to take that risk and we still want to bring amazing companies to users attention and just because we are bringing the companies to users attention we don't think we need a savvy registration for that thing another thing is that we are also planning to replicate the indian model for us companies as well in the coming period we are not sure about the timeline so we don't think that if we apply for savvy registration even if we want to provide any kind of advisory service or tips then it would be a very helpful if we plan to expand our services beyond the India. So that is the core reason that we have not taken the SEBI registration for dark horse stocks. So please keep that in mind that we are not any kind of paid advisory where we give you tips, we give you companies with target prices, you invest for short term or you invest a lot of money. That is not the case with dark horse stocks. We only provide you information about the companies which we feel must be brought to the user's attention. So please keep this in mind. We are once again emphasizing this point that we are not savvy registered and we want you to we want to be completely honest with you. So that is the main thing that we have taken a lot of time on specifically this topic. Moving on, uh, what will you get in the paid subscription? So basically our subscription model is that we publish one article every week. OK, almost every week, sometimes when the market is at the top or it's on the it's uh, probably going to go down, we don't publish any articles, uh, but mostly one article per week. And in free plan, we give only one company per month. That is around 10 ideas per year and you won't get access to any of the penny stock ideas. While in the paid subscription, you will get access to all the ideas. You will also get access to the past ideas and you will also get access to penny stock ideas. Now, there are multiple plans. Uh, based on that, the services are bifurcated, but even in the basic plan, you will get access to all the dark cost stock ideas, past, present and future. Number of companies will keep on varying. Normally, we, are, we normally propose to keep the companies in between 25 to 45 companies per year. However, if you check our past track record, we have so far suggested almost more than 40 companies every year. So it's not necessary that you, the next year it's also going to be 40 plus. The numbers might keep varying based on the market conditions. 
so do we give target prices or exit prices as we have cleared this in the first slide as well we do not provide any target prices entry exit prices at all however where there are few companies like uh, when we write article about a company there are few companies where we personally invest side by side so what we can do is that normally when we invest our own money we put some money into the company let's say we are putting 100 rupees into a company what we normally do is that we book partial profits like after 25 or 30 percent the company has gained we book around like 30 to 50 percent of profits and when we keep the remaining 50 percent of profits for at least two to three years or sometimes even if the company is good we don't book any partial profit at all so all the ideas are like all the companies are for long term so it's up to you whenever you want to book the profits it's completely up to you we don't advise any on anything on that okay if you choose to invest it is completely up to you and if you want to book profits it's your choice we don't provide any advice is related to that point that point uh, what is the pricing and how would, la, would the subscription be valid so uh, last year what happened was that uh, the subscription was valid for one year so normally it is valid for one year but as we all know that we open for subscription only twice a year and what happens is that a lot of people forget that subscriptions are open then they later come to us for subscriptions it's not that we don't we want you to wait for the subscription or anything like that we don't want you to like chase but the point is that once we close the subscription we don't have any mechanism to accept your payments because the entire system is automated and if we keep it open you see there is a lot of cost associated with that thing so from this year specifically to this subscription cycle what we have actually planned is that irrespective of whenever you subscribe let's say the subscription will be open till 15th november or 30th november irrespective of any date you subscribe your subscription will be valid till 2nd november 2024 that's it so if you uh, subscribe on a later date there might be some loss on your part for a part of days we don't care about that thing but for this year onwards, we are going to expire all your subscriptions specifically on 2nd November 2024. So your subscription, if you subscribe today, will be valid till one year, valid for one year till to the 2nd November 2024. Next is the pricing. So we have kept, tried to keep the pricing plans as minimal as possible. And also on our website, we have given a list of other advisories what other advisories are charging so if you feel our prices are very high or our services are not up to the mark you can select any of the paid sebi registered advisories from that list we completely have no objection to that in fact in order to make your uh, research easier we have provided with all the details of all the paid advisories out there so it's up to you to check our pricing plans are very minimal it's like 11,950 that's almost 12,000 rupees that is the least we can go so please do not ask for any discount or any more other referral discounts or anything like that. Next is the 17,940 rupees. So the plan to includes a model portfolio. So basically we are working on a model portfolio. We don't provide any portfolio advisory service or anything. We are devising a model portfolio to test the market conditions that how our portfolio performs over the period. And if it is suitable, then we can start our own PMS on a later date. So far we have only added five companies to the model portfolio. So if you are willing to go for that 17,940, 40 rupees plan will be providing with a model portfolio and will also provide you to access of fund analysis so basically this plan is for all those users who are like more interested in the research they can find out what mutual funds are buying what mutual funds are selling each month with the help of fund analysis platform so if you are a small investor we would, we would suggest you to stick to plan one but however if you are interested in finding out the model portfolio companies like how we are going to develop the model portfolio where the market is down where we are uh, planning to add money or like we are planning to add lump sum into mutual funds so that is what we are will be sharing with you in the plan too so where can we check the past performance well uh, the detailed past performance right now has been uploaded on our instagram page as dark horse underscore stocks so you can go there and check it check the same uh, we also attach the link in this description so you can check our past performance from the instagram post as for the users who are willing to subscribe we have a dedicated dashboard but that dashboard for now is limited to paid subscribers only with that dashboard you can check all our past ideas all the performance since of all the stocks that we have suggested like whichever company we have suggested what has been the growth rate of that company and so many details as of now no one else provides this kind of dashboard that 
and one of the core reason that nobody else provides this kind of dashboard is because it reveals your true performance okay so when an advisory is trying to lure the customers for purchasing their subscription they don't want to show that true performance okay so that is the core reason that nobody else provides this kind of dashboard second of second thing is that this dashboard is extremely costly to maintain and in fact the infrastructure cost to create this dashboard is also very high so we don't believe that anyone else out there provides this kind of detailed dashboard analytics uh, which are the modes of the payment supported well we support all the modes of payment so we have integrated the paytm payments gateway into our website as well as the resope payment gateway so you can pay by international credit card debit card direct gpay you can also directly transfer to our bank account so we can we accept all the modes of payment whichever mode is uh convenient to you you can pay via that mode however if you are paying other than the paytm payment gateway if you are paying directly via gpay or bank transfer then we would recommend you to send us a screenshot of the payment along with your email address and your mobile number so in case your subscription is not activated we would activate that subscription manually okay you can send the screenshot and the details on support at the redarkhorsestocks.in and on our whatsapp number as well and uh, that is the last thing that where can you connect for the support so these are the modes of where, where you can you can connect us for the support however if you don't hear from us within 24 hours on any one of the mode you can surely send us a message on any other mode so chances are that the infrastructure might be down so we might not be able to respond you within 24 hours we normally make sure to respond within maximum one to two hours sometimes due to any unforeseen circumstances we might take a bit longer to respond so that was all for the paid subscription if you like this thing if you are actually trusting darbo stocks then we would strongly suggest you to take a one year paid subscription it would help us a lot to develop other platforms as well as to invest more into our own startup because we are not uh, seeking any outside fundings and one of the core reason is that when you seek funds your core motive changes from providing better services to provide earning more money and that is not the goal of darko stocks so we would strongly recommend you go for a paid subscription and even if you don't want to take paid subscription you can still stick to the free plan where we will be suggesting one company every week that's it okay so if you have any queries feel free to drop us a message thank you